On December 16th, 1969, I was born right here in the Holy Cross Hospital in Calgary. My father had driven my mother in from Strathmore, and after a 22-hour labor, sometimes very difficult, I arrived in this world. Now, my parents should have taken that as a sign from above that often life would be difficult when dealing with their son, Kent. After arriving in Calgary, I immediately took up hockey, and for the next eight years or so, my life was a continual merry-go-round from hockey rink to baseball diamond to swimming pool. I went to Sir Winston Churchill High School. My final year, I did have the opportunity to play for the legendary coach Don Phelps, now in his 30th season coaching the Calgary Canucks. That year in the 89-90 hockey season, we won the Alberta Junior Hockey League Championship. The following year in 1990, I entered school at Mount Royal College. I got to play with the College Cougars. I went to the University of Calgary. And let me tell you something, probably the most difficult day of my life was not the day after I got shot. It was that day I went back to University of Calgary. He went back to university. He got a degree. He became a lawyer. He went now and is the uh, member of the Legislative Assembly for Calgary Buffalo. And with all of those things, he brings to this candidacy the real true power, and that is a person who belongs to a team. Of course, that's uh, an inspiration for me, and I think it's an inspiration for many people because they, they see that uh, that life is what you make it, that uh, you can face adversity and uh, although it's not easy, you can very often overcome it. Ken has always had dreams and goals and aspirations and he's always set his sights very high. I'm more of the realist and he is the go-getter type. I can do whatever I set my mind to. And um, when he decided he was going to run for mayor, I thought, well, you know, he, he's the right kind of guy. He, he has experience in politics, he's friendly, he's outgoing, he has moral, good morals and intentions and he wants the best for everybody and he's concerned about the community. And